first full night of sleep in a long time. Uh, I'm stoked right now. The swell's probably dead, but the winds are light, so there's a chance there's still waves. We're gonna see what we can do. All right, young grums. I'm not sure if I'm gonna go out here because I'm always like scared to surf alone at this spot, but there's little waves, not even breaking that far out. The tide's about to be high. <laughs> Sorry, I'm probably looking at a psychopath right now, but I'm making my way to the spot. And I wanted to talk to you guys about something. Honestly, I'm really scared to surf alone, and I always am like terrified to surf alone. But I thought I might just be honest with you this time about my fears. Yeah, I'm like definitely scared to surf alone because of sharks. I've never said this before, but I'm like absolutely terrified. I'm also terrified of like getting injured and like having to like crawl across the rocks on my own and like not being able to have anyone to help. But yeah, whenever I surf alone, I'm super scared and I finally just wanted to put that out there. I mean, I've surfed Jaws alone. I've surfed up in Maine, like these super gnarly spots, but I just wanted to be honest about my fears and hopefully that'll help me overcome them. Circles that grow and they swallow people lives they say goodnight to wives they'll never know and a mind full of questions and a teacher in my soul and so it goes don't come closer or i'll have to go holding me like gravity are places that pull if ever there was someone to keep me at home In cages they bought They think of me and my wandering But I'm never what they thought Got my indignation But I'm pure in all my thoughts I'm alive Wind in my hair I feel part of everywhere Underneath my being Is a road that disappears I tried my best out there. It was kind of breaking right on the rocks. And yeah, I was a little scared out there, but one thing I do to try to like mitigate my fear is instead of like, when things get really intense, like when I'm surfing up in New England alone or something, and like there's this like deep blue water around me, it's pretty gnarly. I just like trying to think about how beautiful it is and not like how scared I am. So I'm just like, wow, this is beautiful, this is beautiful. And that was enough for me to just to get a few waves. Oh, look, there's still a little wave running pretty close to the rocks but uh we'll be back we'll surf again more today so tired right now i'm so gassed i don't know walking across these cliffs surfing running i was able to sleep like eight nine hours last night but i am so tired right now we're at another spot uh giving it one more try let's do this
I just got out of us two sessions. It was super fun. I'm actually stoked. I got to surf with my uncle. He's a radical individual. And uh, I am tired. I am so tired. But it's a labor of love. We love surfing. We love getting out there. To get up and make a surf vlog every day is super hard. But we don't always have waves here. Don't always have the opportunity to surf. So every day I can surf. Every opportunity I have, I'm going to take it no matter how tired I am. Definitely need to rest today. I got a ton of editing that I'm gonna do, but as always, we will see you on the next swell. This is the one where I went inside and outside of the wave. Okay. Hey, you're just starting. Mm -hmm. no, okay, now you're inside. Ooh, that must have been fun. <laughs> yeah, was that, that was fun? good. That was good. Oh, you just hit your head down. Yeah. Just fine. <laughs>